Hey there guys, Luke here with the Outdoor Gear Review. I hope you're all doing well. Today for this episode, we are taking a look at a ferro rod, and this product is from Exotac. And this is the Poly Striker XL. Go ahead and get comfortable, let's get started. Before we get this ferro seam rod out in the field and use it, let's go ahead and look at the packaging here. And as you can see, Exotac, made in the United States. I know that will be important to many people. 5,500 degree sparks. Ultra light at 1.4 ounces. Waterproof, naturally. Long lasting up to 10,000 strikes. That's pretty impressive. And as you can see there, Poly Striker XL. Let's go over to the striker itself. And as you can see here, here's the ferro rod. Here's the handle. Has a nice piece of cordage, very long, nice lanyard. The striker is integrated into the handle, which is very, very smart. You just simply push it out like that. Very sharp angles on that. And that is tungsten carbide. I'm excited to see how well this works. Now, since it's a beautiful day here in the high country, we might as well use this ferro rod and get a fire going. Just a quick flame, just to show you guys how well it performs. Now, for this, I am gonna use some dry leaves. This is readily available, it's all over the landscape. So, there you go. And I have a nice little bundle of dry leaves. Let's use this as our tender. Let's get a fire going. I'm gonna go ahead and start by tearing up these leaves. It is fairly windy today, so I don't want to get a big blaze going. I just want to get it lit and then put it out. So we'll go ahead here and just do a couple practice scrapes. Get that coating off. Whew. All right. I didn't even mean to get that lit. I was just practicing getting some of that black coating off and doing some scraping there. Perfect. All right, let's go ahead and do that one more time, but intentionally. Gah, that thing burns so hot. Now what I like about this is that when you go to shower those sparks, like it's real big chunks of spark, of ferroceum that's landing on your tender bundle. Now as you saw there, it worked very, very well with leaves. So we'll go ahead and just move on over to some bark. We got those leaves burning on accident. I wasn't even attempting really to get them going. I was just showering sparks, getting that black coating off the ferroceum rod. So here we go, my friends. <laughs> All right, let's try that again. It burned a little bit. One more time. Ah, feels good. When you're done with the striker, you just simply put it back into the handle and it pops into place just like that. Very nice. Now for the Poly Striker XL, this is a very nice ferro serum rod, no doubt about it. It definitely showers sparks, but it does a really good job of throwing big, large chunks that burn for a while. Now, when it comes to the Poly Striker XL, there are three different colors available. There's a red. This is, this is the red one, but it actually looks orange to me, so what do I know? But they call it red. There's also a black, and there's a gray version. These run $16 on Amazon. There's also a smaller size, just the traditional, regular Poly Striker. It runs $12. The larger size is good for 10,000 strikes. The smaller one is good for 1,200 strikes, and they're almost the same price. Yes, there's a little bit of a weight difference. This is 1.4 ounces. The smaller one is half an ounce. So if you're looking for something for ultra light purposes, you may want to go with the smaller size. So my friends, for our look at the Exotac Poly Striker XL, that's pretty much it. If you guys have any questions for me, please feel free, drop me a line, let me know. Make sure to like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff, and I will see you guys around. Strength and honor, be well.